Okay, so if you didn't know what you clicked on when you clicked into this trail video, it's part of a larger choose your own adventure series down Whistler Mountain Bike Park. And we started at Top of the World, and after Top of the World, the choice was yours. Whether to hit single black no joke and freight train, blue flowy Una Moss to Blueberry Bathtub, or all the way down Creekside. And in this video, we are hitting the flowiest option down the mountain, which is Una Moss and Blueberry Bathtub. And don't forget that at the end of this video, when we wind up at the top of the Fitzsimmons zone, you're going to be able to choose what you want to do from there. All right, let's get to it. All right. Chose Una Moss. Pretty happy about that. I have not been doing too much of the heart attack riding yet. So, because he shows Una Moss, I've time warped you up the trail a little bit. So you can see some of this stuff that was above. It's my first time hitting this. So, let's assume it all goes well. <laughs> first time hitting this in a few years anyways. Wow. Luna Moss is kind of like, I mean, everything in the Garbo zone is bigger. The trails are longer, the firms are higher, the jumps in general are bigger. Oh, here comes one now. Whee! Um, so it's a lot of fun. This one, compared to Blue Velvet, has a lot less jumps on it, but just tons of fun flow. All right. Without the need to worry about bigger jumps, if you're not keen on that. All right. So here you can cut off Seven Year War. It's another single black tech trail. It's really fun. Kind of tighter in the trees. We headed down to where, it, whoa, should have gone there. We are headed down to where you caught up with me at the end of Top of the World. Here we are, into the tunnel. Oh my gosh, that looks so slippery. Down the road. A couple of little berms to slow you down. So now, instead of going uh, left over to the more single black stuff. We are going to go right. And this is Una Moss slash Weasel Juice. And over there to our left, that's also the top of the Creekside Gondola, which is definitely the place to go if you don't like waiting in lines <laughs> to get on the lift, because it's always quiet there. I don't think I've ever waited in a line longer than like two people on Creekside, so. And on Creekside, there's also free covered parking. Woo! That's actually where I'm staying on this trip is over on Creekside. This is great, especially if you are staying on Creekside, you wind up coming up the gondola and you obviously can take the Creekside trails, which are awesome. But if you're wanting to get over to the fit zone to some of those iconic trails you've heard about, like crank it up and A-line and all that kind of stuff, this is the way you do it. Um, staying as far as like easier blue flow, this is the way you go. All right, this away. And so what we're gonna do is, we're gonna keep the flow going. We're gonna hit another blue trail, blue flow trail called Blueberry Bathtub. It's just so nice, especially on a hot day like today, to take the flow trails because, ah, just like nice breeze. You actually get some speed and you keep it up there. Oh, the berms, so good. 
they're the masters out here, I tell you. Right. Little Alder. So you come out of Unamas slash Weasel Juice, and then you hit Little Alder, which is just, right now because it's so loose, it's a little sketchy, but normally it's just perfect. Berm after berm after berm, you'll see. And it's a good time. Then after that, you go down the road and into Blueberry Bathtub. Little Alder. <laughs> Crazy. So cool. Pop out on the road. Clean that bike. Blueberry bathtub. Do what I always do on trails like this. So flow trails, especially ones with just lots of berms. It's a lot of weight that goes down onto your body over and over and over again. And if you're kind of 50-50 weight with your feet and your hands, it just burns out your arms and your hands so fast. So I like to put, I mean, almost all of my weight just on my feet. Like obviously there's a bit of weight on my hands, but not very much. Like if I were just going in a straight line, I could take my hands off my bars and be kind of balanced there. You guys all good? And so, I mean, your leg muscles, they're a lot stronger than your arm muscles, so let them take the weight. You can jump. Oh, oh wow, so good. Pretty much down the fifth zone now. Pretty close, I think. Here we go. And with that, you have now officially made it all the way down from the peak zone with Top of the World, down through the Garbanzo zone, and now you find yourself at the top of the most iconic zone of Whistler Bike Park, the Fitzsimmons Zone. And let me tell you, you have some amazing choices here. Do you want to take the most famous blue flow trail in the world, crank it up, or a gnarly, gnarly double black tech route down to the bottom of the mountain, led by none other than Nick from Van Can? You get a little bonus dual slalom action with a bonus, bonus crash by me at the end of that one too. Or do you want to finish off this top to bottom lap of Whistler with the most famous bike trail in the world, A-Line, headed up by Kaz from Mahalo, my dude. Tough, tough choices to make here. I think you'll make the right one. And plus, you can always go back and watch the other ones too. So thanks for watching this one, and we'll see you at the top of whatever trail you choose next. Cheers. Cheers.